Update 13, Flames, Frost, and more. And the British are coming. The British are coming. Let's dive into it. Today's gameplay brought to you by Tiger. Tiger, no longer an endangered species. So Hell Let Loose, the latest dev brief cleared up a few things, as well as confirmed a few things, and we're going to jump right into there right now. First though, if you guys are enjoying the video, the content here on this channel, please maybe drop a like, subscribe to the channel, and hit that bell notification so you don't miss any more information coming out, new videos. I appreciate your support immensely. Cheers, you guys. So we had some inklings uh, several months ago that British forces were probably going to be coming to Hell Let Loose sometime in the future, although there was no timetable for that. It's been confirmed now, and uh, it's probably going to be happening a hell of a lot sooner than we expected. In the end of the intro of their brief, it reads, Lastly, we're thrilled to announce that our aim is to release the Commonwealth expansion as our first major update of 2023. We will be announcing an updated roadmap to reflect this in the coming weeks, creating an expansion with a whole new force suite of weaponry and vehicles, as well as new maps. Is this a time-consuming process and one that we're keen to get right? We're excited to share this with you as we continue to work through its creation. We're very excited to introduce a whole new theater of war and are excited for the new maps this enables us to develop. So while that doesn't tell us an actual release date for this, the fact that it's going to be the first release uh, as a major update in 2023, that's big news, and uh, that means the wait for this is not, is not going to be very long at all, which is really, really cool. So update 13 is going to be the last update of the year, and it will be before the end of the year. So this is going to be happening uh, not very long from now. Uh, they're going to be adding a new tank, the T-70, Soviet T-70, a new winter map, winter uniforms, jeeps, flamethrowers. That'll be interesting to see how the, they add that in. Recon improvements and new cosmetics as well along with all the additional gameplay items that are being put into Update 13. There's also going to be a host of quality of life improvements, which come with pretty much every update, so that shouldn't be too big of a surprise, but a welcome one too. Let's cross our fingers. Maybe they'll, uh, maybe they'll allow us to lay down on unflat surfaces, you know, without uh, having to look straight in the direction of that surface where it's pointed. If you know what I'm talking about, like laying on a rock and not being able to look up or down because the rock is angled a certain way, that'd be great. Uh, so, a lot to look forward to here. I think it'd be fair to assume we might be looking for this towards the end of November or early December. I can't wait for it, guys. Hope you're having a great week. Thank you for stopping by. Really appreciate it. Enjoy yourselves. Take care of yourselves. And we'll see you later.